G'day guys, Alex from Tactical Arbitrage here and I wanted to go through a series of videos to help new people understand and operate the Tactical Arbitrage software. Uh, it can be a little daunting for people who've never used the software before and uh, inevitably we get asked a lot of the same questions and I figured a series of videos might be the best way to go about explaining things. So uh, I'll make each video kind of short but one e each one will touch on um, touch on one page at a time. So uh, this is the page that you're met with when you very first log into the system and I want to just run across these links at the top here and uh, with and let you know what they do. Don't worry about these links off to the side here these are these are links that are uh, relevant only to myself and um, they shall forever remain a secret. But over on the left side here uh, is the links that you should see and should be able to operate and uh, here's what they do. So the product search page is this page here and this is where you'll enter in all of your data uh, for a search. Say for example target and uh, the category and, and your start and end page, a bunch of filters and then you can hit submit and operate a search. And on this page you'll see process running and I'll go into this view data page in a lot more, uh, sorry this product search page in a lot more detail in a moment. Now the view data page is where you'll see uh, products and deals that are starting to come in and uh, you'll see things like a gross return on investment and uh, and you'll see other things such as the, uh, the items and once again I'm going to go into this page in a lot more detail. Now download data will get a CSV of this page coming down onto your computer that you can then, uh, that you can then open up and uh, analyze these details there. You might be making gumroad lists to sell perhaps. Um, there's nothing against you doing that. Uh, or you may just want to want to keep a record of uh, what you've decided to save from that view data page so that you can look at it in a spreadsheet way a little later. And uh, you know, spreadsheets are also great for tracking what you have and haven't purchased as well uh, and keeping files. The save list is a good place to save any of these. So for instance, if I like this Marvel Avengers Titan Hero Series item, I can click the little save part there. Um, it goes red. This is a new little feature just so you know you've clicked it. And then if you pop on into the save list, you'll see that that item is now there added at the bottom. So this is used very much as a test page for me. Uh, so ignore uh, these products here. They, these are just items I've shoved in here um, while running some tests. So there's not much in the way of a gross return on investment here. Um, now a lot of this stuff does things and again I'm going to go into the save list page in greater detail later. Now you won't see much on the products variation page here uh, because I'm not running a, a scan but if I was to put in a, uh, a shoe for instance and a price that I can buy that shoe for then I uh, can go into more detail here, analyze pages of reviews and find out uh, which items sell the best and not only that but which ones are the most profitable based on my buy price. Now we have an advanced user page here uh, which we'll go into in some greater detail as well uh, which are related to adding your own sites. The settings page is going to require a little bit of explanation. We've got some cool settings in there and the way you set this up is going to affect the speed of your searches. And uh, in the support section here is where you can send me an email. Frequently asked questions, uh, we'll try and update this as much as possible and maybe uh, put some of these video links in there. And uh, planned updates, we haven't really been using this so much because our Facebook group is so, uh, so heavily used that most of the updates are going into there as soon as they happen. Uh, so the planned updates page probably could do with a bit of an update but to really keep abreast of what's going on I suggest you participate and join the Facebook group which is facebook.com slash groups slash tactical arbitrage. Uh, so that's pretty much the um, the dashboard in general. I will uh, now stop this video and then the next video will take some time to check out this product search page. Thanks.